behalf of this government, I do commission this staff for proper use. Yeah. Yeah. Pakwach District Leadership as today, 14th June 2024, commissioned solar powered water system donated by Minister of Water and Environment aimed at improving access to clean water in 10 villages of Moter West, Moter East, Ajay East, Pailo West, among others in Wadlai Sub County, Pakwach District. While commissioning the water system, Ashile Tribal, the Deputy Resident District Commissioner Pakwach District, who was the chief guest, notes that the powered solar water system will increase access to water in 10 villages which have been facing a major challenge in the district. This man who you see here seated today very happy. Some few years ago they were not happy. Do you know why? By midnight, their women will not be around. So this man is allowed to tolerate the coldness. <laughs> From midnight up to morning. Because this woman is off for looking what? Looking for what? Our girl child has been a, a worse at that time. Honorable Robert Omito Steen, Pakwach District Chairperson, commends the government for this initiative before calling upon the community to embrace and protect the water source for future use. The potential of our young people were draining because of uh, uptake of bad water, dirty water. And so, I want to congratulate the government of the Republic of Uganda and then the good stewardship of General Yuri Kaguta Museveni. He is a hero, a legend, and also a guru in terms of fighting what caused human life. This contributes to health. It contributes to education. Dr. Aito Isaiah, senior sociologist in the Ministry of Water and Environment has tasked the community members to take charge of the water system to extensively maintain it before warning them of vandalism. The work that we do as Ministry of Water and Environment are basically three. The first work that we do as a ministry is that of ensuring that every Ugandan in the rural areas and in the urban has access to clean and safe water. That is the mandate that we wake up every morning to achieve. The second is to see that our environment is preserved. The third is to see that we regulate the usage of the resources that we have, both water and environment, such that they are able to meet the current needs of the current population, but also we are able to sustain them to meet the needs of the future generation. Joseph Owinji, a member of Motel Water Committee, applauded the Minister of Water and Environment for bringing clean water closer to them. He appealed to the Minister of Water and Environment to add more components of the project to the community surrounding this project. <laughs> The 580 million water project will serve more than 2,500 people in Motel Parish and was constructed by Zong Hao Overseas Construction Engineering Company Limited. Alfred Jawok, West Nile TV, Nilecast.